Hey guys, it's uh, me again. So, uh, yeah, I'm still playing this game. No surprise, huh? I'm uh, just checking a few things because it's been a while since, again, I played. I know I was moving on to her. Okay, she was learning Siren. And I was learning, and he was learning uh, Jupiter. For now. Um, the quest we were on was, I think, the three something, I don't know. Three something, uh, three tasks. Yeah. Mm. Our last task is to fight some kobolds in the earth place. Gotcha. So I'm going to start cutting the video again. I know the last episode I did not cut at all. I just kept on, I went right straight through. I know I'm going to go back to, you know, cutting and putting stuff in so it doesn't take as long. Because I, like I said, this game is, I'm going to guess, well, it's obviously longer than the first and second one. I think it's because of all of this running around in the same area. So, whenever I uh, get to somewhere new, I'll go back to recording. So, when I get there, guys, I'll see you there. And, off we go. Boom. There, now we're in the Kuma area. We're just a few steps away. I took the one cannon to get over here. Just showing you where I kind of am and where I have to get going. Uh, where we're trying to go to is the lake, apparently, from what this... What's it, what it's telling me to go to. Oh, oh. Can you tell if I'm going the wrong way or not? And I stepped on it. So, when I get there, I'll show you. So, uh, Edge learned Soul Burst. So I definitely had to click on record to see it. It's This is actually the second battle. I was backtracking because I went the wrong way. And I accidentally went into a battle. Hey, more time. Now I'm still trying to get over here. Still trying to figure out how to get over there. I am going the right way. Now it's somewhere around here. I'm trying to get over these things. Eesh. And no, we're gonna fight this thing. But now we can try out that soul burst though, so. So what? And that is just annoying. I'm sorry. Freaking Nell's being annoying. Okay, time to do some magic. Man of Storm. Get rid of the two harpies. Bum, 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 bum. Trial our new move. Slow burst. You could win. Wow. That was just amazing. It actually looks like a killer move if I had my thing at maxed. Like, it was a killer move, I'm just saying it could have been even worse. Anyway, I think we're in the room now. Actually, I can't believe I'm making it. And there's the fight. Let's do this. Now they're always strong enough to you. That's exactly what I wanted. Didn't do much. Push them all back. Edge's turn. Try to slaughter the weakest one. Come on. Didn't kill it. Unlucky. I was hoping for one kill at least. Uh, at least we can go another mana storm and hit them all. Yes. That'll defeat one of them and push one back. So now Edge has the, another hit. I'm gonna go for this one instead. Because I know this one's gonna get through. And now she can defeat the one coming up. Which just puts us in the burst mode. And now we finish it with a soul burst. The ultimate attack. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That is an amazing attack. That's just way overpowered. And now we did it. That was actually quite easy. Yep. Uh, what? I swear something was asking help me. What? <sighs> well, it looks like
looks like we got a, another boss fight to fight. Uh oh. Now we're facing a dragon. Ooh, pushed him back just enough. I'm still gonna use Mana Storm because it does do a good knockback. resist, but I just need the hits. I'm just trying to build up that burst. Ouch. Still just trying to build it up. Once you have that burst, it's like the ultimate thing. There. Burst mode. Uh, trick or treat. That's a mute. Team Cobalt? Team Cobalt. Good job. Mind's eye. Go ahead, do whatever you want. Wow. I mean, wow, that was close to death. Actually, we're gonna make money. That's some decent damage. But this is what I wanted. Soul burst. I don't care if you're resistant. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. You're almost dead. I need some sort of healing though. Wow, uh, I don't know, we're kinda screwed right now. Soul Eater? Yeah, Soul Eater. It's my now. Come on. Yeah. Gage is almost full. I cover HP. And yourself. Come on, get that burst gauge up. That's what. That's really what's holding my back. Oh no, I think I, Iris is dead, right? Maybe. Ooh. Way close. Okay, you need healing. Okay, I think we're safe now. Come on, fill that gauge. Attack. This last bit shall do it. Never mind, unless he has another turn. It's not fair. Come on! One more hit. Yes, there we go. Boom. Break mode. Like you said, let's finish this soul burst. Goodbye. 12k. He did thought you could win. Blade level up. Nell just learnt. The skill, Tinker Flux. Nice. Oh. We got a new mana. The Rock Mana. Dimela? Dimela? Bleh. 
call you Dottie, for sure. Yeah. Nice job. So now we have Dottie on our team. Iris has made a pack with Dai, the man of stone. Obtain Diamond's blades. Obtain Lancelot. Yeah, we're done. Yeah, with the person that forced us to do this quest. And we're instantly teleported out. And a couple new little points. Nothing, nothing much new. Whew. So I'm gonna quickly save, and then I'll go over to the guild. So I uh, kind of. Oh, never mind. We'll just go there. She's actually the guildmaster. I guess, uh... You know what? Yeah. I guess we're... That's... We can't blame her for her actions now. Yeah, you don't come out of your office, do ya? Cool. Like what? Sweet, so uh, can you give me my next quest so I can get to uh, rank... What am I, rank 700 now? Give me rank 800? I thought Ash was like the top hunter right now, so what? You couldn't get him to do your job, so you want us to do it now? Ash, sure. Okay, thanks. That's cool. Quest cleared. Boom, 200 more points and some superior medicine. What's up? Nothing. Uh, I can't even go over there. This is cheap. All I can do is go back. Yep. Yeah. I don't want to do your quest. Okay, I'm gonna switch for- I'm gonna look for a quest, but we'll, uh, I'll see ya when I can. So, yeah. I'll see you when I can. Hey guys, um, I decided we're gonna go with a flower for you. And like I said, I'm only going for main quest, so... I see this as a main quest, because you're not able to cancel it, so let's go with this one. And it seems easy enough to bring her a bouquet. So, let's do it. Wait, who am I giving this to? I just realized. I always think of something before I go anywhere. We need to deliver a bouquet to a, a reader in the front of the monument. And now I have a whole question of do I even have a bouquet? Uh, 
probably should have thought this one through. Do I have a okay? I'm not a hundred percent sure. But we're gonna look around until we see something. No, that's a fish. We're not looking for a fish, we're looking for some flowers. We're not looking for food, we're still looking for flowers. Uh, weapons. Still looking for some sort of flowers. Ooh, that's a lot. Pretty cool. Hey, it's for uh, Nell. That must be uh, one of her new weapons. Nice. Oh, we do! Sweet, okay, we do have a... Uh, this is gonna be an easy quest, we already have one. So we just have to find the mon mon monument. The question is where? Where is the monument? I'm hoping it just means the middle thing right over here. And that's a uh, no. Okay. I guess we'll be uh, doing a little quick run around, look around thing. So I guess I'll uh, see you when I can find her. Hopefully it's not too long. So I'll see you then. Okay, guys, I realized where the monument was. All I had to do was check my map, and it kind of got it to me. I took a, the wrong right turn. I was supposed to just come down here and take a right turn, and then we would be there. So, if you guys don't know where the monument is, it's just over here. A long distance far away. And over here. Now we're at the monument. Where are you, lady? There you are. Give her a bouquet. Yes, here we go. You're welcome. Now oh, you're a new one. You're welcome. But, it mm, seems a little cheap. quest really that didn't take no time at all so now we're gonna head back to the guild so we can get our next quest but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back to my uh, little base save up and get a check if I can build anything and we'll see uh, whenever we get there okay guys I just created this here's a little HP when your turn comes around I'm totally gonna grab that shrimp here's a lot of HP every turn but slow it down your speed I almost feel like saying yes, but that'd be a little too much. I'm gonna maybe go with critical hit for this one. That's be cool. Critical hit and auto heal. Yeah. For her weapon. So I just created that. I'm just looking for things I can create right now. a lot, but I don't think it has, oh, it did have things, but I want to change it to auto heal and medium crit. Nice. That has a better technique. This has auto heal plus two. That's a crazy one. Uncrafted. Can't craft that. This is uncrafted. Can't craft that yet. So I said, I'm just searching for things I can craft right now. This isn't crafted. Sure. Let's create this. I forgot what this even was. Boom, idle costume. I'm gonna give you an extra hit. Uncrafted. Still missing some sort of thing for that. This is uncrafted. Missing something for it. And uncraft it. I can't do that yet. Rings. Can't do that one yet. Can't do that 
one just yet. I can't do that one just yet. I need a brilliant stone to make this ring. Okay, I could probably still make it though. This one? No. I just need a brilliant stone, which I think is right around here somewhere. Or here somewhere. There's. I'm just gonna make two for the just because we can use them later on. And now we gotta go to the rings. We can now make this that I've never ever made. Oh, that's a whole different speed. Because this one, this one. Because it's cheaper. And because I like that. And boom! A new fire ring. I like that because then I have a chance to poison an enemy, but I like this because it gives me more experience at the end of the battle. I almost feel like maybe give them more experience because it sounds like a better ring. Yeah, make the ring more experience. Okay, so I uh, got a couple new things, which is all cool. It's a medium, it's a small attack, but add block. I guess we'll do that one. This gives me experience. Crap. Doesn't help because I was gonna put a ring on. Keep the one extra hit. My medium attack. Oh, wait, I got two things. Okay, I see what's going on. Because my clothes gives me my bonus, but I can't do nothing because it's like the best clothes. Okay, so I can't do nothing about that. This is as good as he can get for now. For her. That's yeah, the best thing we can get her there. Ice ring gives her resist. This gives her block. I don't want to give her block. I want to give her... I can give her plus one hit, but not I don't give her this thing. No flame. Yeah. So now she has Ice Storm and Hellfire. She's, 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 thin. she's got an Ice move and a Fire move. Plus she's getting bonus experience, because she's got experience. And he's also got experience bonus. She's the only one without experience bonus. It's better to that weapon. Charge L. Oh, this is a better one. It just has no extra ability, though. Which sucks. Ooh, idol costume! Which is way better, because it gives her an extra hit. I do like the healing. It gives her a resistance, too. Black hat! Okay, that doesn't count. I was gonna say that would be sick if that counted. I could give her more defense. Block. You got block, 
experience bonus, plus one to hit, and medium attack. You've got medium attack, medium magic, medium stun, medium resist, and experience bonus. So, yeah. You're the only one that's not getting extra, uh, extra uh, experience. Basically, I'm getting my edge and iris as high as possible while now. You're kind of there just for backup. You're like the healer. That's why you have block and extra hit. Edge apparently can hit three times plus one hit, that's four hits. For you, you can hit four times. You, you can hit five times. So we got a four hitter, a four hitter, a five hitter. Yeah, that's nice. Uh, I, like I said, I'm gonna go save and then we'll head over to the quests. Okay, we'll, we just got to the guild again. Now we're gonna start looking at the quests to find what quests we can do. Hmm. There's two ones that we can do. I think it's just these two. Last time I ignored this one. So we're gonna actually go with... Wait, Pamela. That's 100 points. This one's 200 points. I know this could give me my thing faster, but let's go with Pamela. That's 100 points. So which, what's the best one again? Basically, we're gonna go see Pamela. So, let's go head over to Pamela, which is in the library, and we'll be there as soon as we can. Hey guys, uh, I got into a battle in the library. I just want to try out this Tinker Flex, which is a large attack. There's a bunch of enemies, so this is perfect. Let's try it out. That was cool. I wiped out a good bunch of them. It reminds me of uh, the mana thing, except for. I would say it, it only cost one instead of two, but this one knocked back down and it doesn't. So now I got two death knights to deal with. Mm, that's gonna be fun. Um, something new. Just fight. Life drain. Life drain. Now. Let's do it again. Just because I liked it. Bam! I wanted to, I want to test out the heat wave, but I keep forgetting. Yeah. Goodbye. Not good enough. So we're gonna go get the heat, we're gonna test out that new heat wave spell for the ring we just got on the next enemy we can get to. Always why I'm using fire right there is to take a shortcut to uh, Pamela. Bam, stairs. It's just to get up here faster. Whatever, he didn't want to fight. Okay, we'll use the fire thing here, because I really want to test it out. Get the shadow girl. Oh, that was fast. I want to test out my heat wave. Actually, that hits everybody. Holy beep. That was actually amazing. Just because it's a spell that was equipped with a ring. Usually I don't care for those spells. But I guess because it cost two mana, it was actually decent. Even the ice spell, I know, is like... I don't really care for the spells as much because the spares, spells are always not the greatest. I guess if the enemy's weak against them, they do do quite a lot of damage. And now that she knows ice and fire, we could probably wipe with the field. Very easily, depending if they're weak against it. See, like, this thing is dead because it's weak. And, of course, she gets, like, five hits. See, it was weak against ice. I could use an ice to wipe it out one shot. But it's weak as shit, so I didn't need to. I like how uh, Iris and Edge get bonus experience. So anyway, we're very close to Pamela. Except for I keep on bumping into weak enemies. <sighs> it's weak against fire, though. Bam, 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 bam. Edge's turn. I'm gonna try it. Who's the weak against ice? Oh, sorry. Hellfire. Try it. See what happens. And yes, sorry, I just realized the ice spell. 
they're not weak against, uh, what's it called? Yeah. We can finish off this one. And she can finish off this guy. Ow. For being a weak enemy, they, they got some decent attacks. We're at the library, where it's just like the one hallway left. Oh, we are in the library, which is good down. Hey, Pamela. What you got for us? With? Oh. the library and go for the, I believe it's the last one, because it said uh, random woman, random guy, Hagel, which was the weapon owner, and what did this guy's name again was? Start with E. Yvonne. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Friggin' Romeo right there. And thank god it's teleporting me. I feel like friggin' going back to that whole dungeon just to talk to Pamela. It, it, it's done that to me a couple times so far.
Eh, not a problem. It's true. <laughs> what is it? You just went through that. Okay. <laughs> okay. So we got 100 points and a black mustard shield. Cool. I want to check that out. Quick. The under armor, right? No. No. It's under accessory. Okay, I'm not sure what's under. Oh. Oh, it's for Nell, that's why. It's Nell's armor. Brings up her defense actually quite a lot. It might be better than the idol costume, but it's got no uh, properties, so it's not the greatest. So we'll just leave it alone for now until we get some properties for it. So uh, let's collect this, like we regularly do, and head back to town. So we can get ourselves a new quest. So I'll see you at the guild, guys. Well, we're finally here, so let's see what quest we can get. There's one can, uh, not cancelable one. This one right here. Broken Crystal. So... Go to Anna at the counter. Hmm. Easy enough. Know anything about the Broken Crystal? Oh, so we're going to Crystal Valley. Alright, let's go. So we're going to head to the village, talk to the chief. Then he's probably going to tell me how to craft something. Most likely. And then we'll have to go back and talk to him. Ugh. I hate friggin' quests that revolve going into a dungeon just to talk to someone, just to leave the dungeon, to build something, to go back in the dungeon, to give it to them, kind of thing. That's what I'm guessing. Happened way too many times so far. Though. And gladly I know at least the crystal one is just on its way up here. Has to be the farthest one, too. The right one, right? Right there, that's not far. It's just north all the way. Pretty cool, though. You know what? I'm just gonna record once we get there, because there's no point of watching me get all the way there. So, we'll see you soon. Okay, we just got to the village. Now I'm just looking for the chief. Are you the chief? Pretty sure you are. Oh, yeah. Got it right. Eh, kinda. Kind of, yeah. Hmm. Jesus. The same thing, right? Let's 
chair. Cool, so how do you get him? Oh, so you need an alchemist. <laughs> you obtain the recipe for the breath of earth. Earth. Yeah. So now, we're gonna head back to town, and I guess we're gonna do some crafting. That should be hard. Oh, a few new points. Nothing else. Let's craft. I'm looking for Breath of Birth. Where is it? Oh, it's a key item. First, I'm gonna make eight of them. Oh, we did it. Now they're gonna force me to go all the way back. Right? Well, this sucks. Such a long way, all the way over, back over the crystal area. So, let's see. Uh, I don't know how long, much longer this game is, guys. And I kind of really want it to end, because like I said, I got bored after a while playing this game. And I know there's two other games I kind of put away. But I've been playing them off screen just a little bit to get stronger and better, which you'll find out very soon once this game is over with. But my first plan right now is I'm going to uh, recover everything. Kind of oh, what's happening? Yes, sweet. We got teleported. Breath of Earth. Ooh! Fixed it! Hmm. Okay. That's why I made an extra seven more. Because I knew they'd be important. There we go, 200 new points. And a rank up, nice. We're going to rank eight now. Fohin. And we're going to magic kunai. So, we're on, I believe, a mission now. Okay, another gem is showing up. Right? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, Ash is there. Hmm. He gave up fast. He's just like, yeah, I'm not fighting anything. Spellbound lin lineage. Right? That's what, I think that's what it says. Mm. 
do, do, do. Hey, short, shorty. What? What? Ah, <laughs> oh, sweet. Thanks. Some sort of new mission. We'll find out get or he's probably gonna tell us to go investigate that uh, glowing orb that we just saw in the preview. Makes sense. Well, hello. It's great to see you. Uh, not to you either. What do you have for us? I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. This. What? And this is well, as you can see, it's a note. No crap. Ooh. It's the first dungeon, right? Yeah. Ooh. The first rank? Ah, yeah, he's number one rank. Yeah. Jesus. So he's just rude or an asshole. Thanks. Yeah. Sweet. So I guess we'll, we know what we're going to do. So I'll see you when we get to the dungeon.